After two years of waiting, animal welfare advocates and family members watched and waited for Judge Davis to announce her sentencing decision for Elmer Givens. Givens was arrested in March of 2021 and charged with 74 counts of animal cruelty and one count of animal fighting. Givens pleaded guilty to 10 of those charges. It was very disturbing. Kirsten uh, Gregory of Posado's Safe Haven has been watching the case develop and says it's vital that Givens be punished for the abuse of dozens of dogs. Over 107 dogs that we know of were abused and neglected by him. Some were shot with BB guns, some were severely malnourished and emaciated. So, I mean, the, the level of seriousness of this crime against animals is, is pretty huge. Two through ten. The prosecuting attorney recommended Givens serve six months in prison. And Givens' attorney argued that anything longer than that could severely impact his family. But given the nature of the crimes, the judge disagreed. Reaching a sentence that is sufficient enough to uh, reach the desired effect and impress upon you the seriousness of your crime, that's from your attorney. I do not believe that six months is sufficient. She went on to add another four months, which means Givens will serve a total of 10 months in prison. He'll then be placed on probation for the next two years. I hope this sends a message that law enforcement, animal control, and our prosecutors and judges take these crimes very seriously and be warned. Givens is also banned from owning, possessing, or residing with an animal from here on in. Meanwhile, Gregory says she's excited about legislation that's made it to the governor's desk that will make getting animals out of abusive situations easier and will happen sooner. But for now, we're live in Tacoma. Lionel Donovan, King 5 News.